To the British, he was a pirate. To the rebellious British subjects of America, he was their first and greatest naval hero. Would there be a memorial to John Paul Jones in Washington's West Potomac Park had his Revolutionary War exploits been limited to some daring hit-and-run attacks on British merchant vessels? The answer is probably not. For the Scottish-born Jones, a place in the history books was assured on a single day in September 1779. Commanding the slow, underarmed Bonhomme Richard, the name given in tribute to his Parisian patron, Benjamin Franklin, Jones triumphed over the newer, technologically superior British frigate Serapis in a savage North Sea encounter. At the height of the battle, Jones delivered his celebrated rallying cry, I have not yet begun to fight, so at least recounted one of his officers. These same electrifying words appear on the back of Jones' Washington Memorial, along with the depiction of Jones raising the new American flag for the first time on a vessel in service to the United States. Dedicated in 1912, a 10-foot-tall bronze statue of the Admiral is flanked by sculpted dolphins whose snouts water a small pool. A marble column 15 feet in height serves as a backdrop. While Jones's heroism and skill are beyond doubt, the fact is he almost certainly never said, I have not yet begun to fight. The first printed reference to the electrifying phrase appeared in 1825, almost 50 years after the battle, and more than 30 years since John Paul Jones died in Paris, impoverished and largely forgotten. <laughs>